because the youth and hunger in the locker room is going to explode in the ring tonight as we welcome everyone to NXT. And what a great way to start us off. Get ready for some WWE magic. Buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. We have a team led by a real fan favorite versus Vicious and Delicious. I cannot wait. Gentlemen, we have tag team action coming up. And given the state of the tag team division right now and how incredibly competitive it is, this match might just make or break one of these teams. This is the one this crowd has been waiting for, guys. Tag team action coming up. I can't wait, Michael. Like this crowd, I've had my eyes on this match ever since it was announced. This is it, tag team action underway here, guys. All the budding tag teams out there hoping to one day make it to the big stage. Better be watching this match with a notepad in hand because you can bet this is going to be a lesson in how it's done. Ooh. Beautiful technique. Frog. You gotta believe this one's over. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, she might have it. She's looking at it. Nailed it. Jumping neck breaker. Ouch. She better do something fast. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a broke kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss Cyborg. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Ooh, nice Russian leg sweep. Irish whip. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. The team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag. They're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough 
to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. You gotta believe this one's over. Boom, what impact. Face buster, boom. <laughs> Hip attack, so sudden. off the tag. High cross body. She's taking on some offense here. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. Well, she's looked good up until now. She just has to make sure not to absorb too much punishment here. There's a pin now. Beautiful technique. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. Not yet. Oh, right to the face. She's starting to take a beating. By no means is this dire straits for her, though. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches her breath in the corner. Harsh impact. Uh-oh. Outrageous athleticism on the Hurricane the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. Look at the look in her eyes. Oh, the old European uppercut. I can't believe it, Michael. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. Can't imagine what this team has planned now. They've been dominating this matchup. We're about to find out. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. This might be it. Oh, my. Oh, my. It's over. She kicks out at two. Got to put in a little more work than that. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination. We're going to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. Ouch. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage. And that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots. But I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record setting 483 days. Oh man, she's rolling now. Neckbreaker! Oh, an Enziguri! Goodness. Popped up. Oh, and it's trapped now and just bang! Got the reversal. What a stop. Good grief. Big reversal for her there. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team. And she kicks out with relative ease. That's all right, Cole. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. She's on the defensive now. You can see her partner wants to get tagged in here. Much longer she can go on absorbing all this punishment. She needs to find a way to make it to her corner and make the tag. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. That she might. Oh, chin breaking uppercut. That was simply amazing. When she gets in attack mode, look out. This is going to be big, one way or another. Oh, nasty impact. Running clothesline. Uh, I think this is the beginning of the end. Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the Tag Team Title Tournament. 
in the finals, Rhino and Slater took on the Usos to see which team would be the inaugural Tag Team Champions. Ooh, what impact. Ooh, nailed it. There was a lot on the line in the Tag Team Tournament Finals. The Usos wanted to add another Tag Team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. The team with Rhino and Heath Slater was a team no one expected to be in the finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and Heath Slater refused to lose. After a gore from Rhino practically cut Jimmy Uso in half, Rhino and Heath Slater went from an unlikely tag team to the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Never say never in WWE is absolutely right. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Back now inside the ring. A high-risk maneuver that works from that top turnbuckle. Suplex. Look at this. Now. Here she comes on the counter. We'll see if she can turn things around. She is on fire. She's looking a little unsteady. At this point, she really needs to think about making a tag to her partner. She's taking on quite a bit of damage here, guys. And if she doesn't find a way to make the tag soon, this one might be over. I wouldn't worry about her too much, guys. She seems one big move away from picking up the W here. Beautiful technique. Boom, oh, right Can she keep her down? And a kick out. Not even close on that one. Not even close. She's going to need a miracle if she wants back in this one. The tag team partner has to be concerned at this point. Given what they've shown us here tonight, it's a shame that one of these women will have to walk away on the losing end of this one. This might be it! Oh my! You gotta believe this one's over! I can't believe what's gone down so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. Some quickness there. Harsh impact. She might have it. Oh, what impact. Victory is on the horizon. Let's see that one more time. That's a great example of teamwork right there. One, two, three. Let's take another look at these ladies going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. That's a woman on a mission. She's taking care of business. Who could forget this? And that's exactly how she wanted to end this thing. Here are your winners, Cameron. The Queen, E. Rhoda Marie. Vicious and delicious. You heard the ring announcer. This one's over. And here's your winner. Look out, girls. These two women don't look like they plan on ever losing. And it'll be interesting to see the ripple effect.